Hi, I'm George, and my ham radio call sign is EI7 Kilo Oscar. And another one of my short videos in relation to the ICOM IC7300. Uh, this time we're going to have a look at the noise blanker. And uh, we're tuned up here in the middle of 40 meters, more or less. And I have the noise blanker off at the minute. We'll turn up the volume. Ooh, that's nasty. So, I get a lot of this noise on 40 meters, uh, particularly this time of the year. I think it's, I don't know, timers for central heating or something like that. I'm not, I'm not a hundred percent sure. I've, I've always had it, and um, the previous radio I had here, uh, it could deal with it to a certain extent, but not the same as that. Now, um, with the noise blanker, if we press and hold, it brings us in here to this menu, and you can adjust. Now, I have them set, these two settings here maxed out just for 40 meters, more or less, and uh, you can play around with the level, but if you go too high, it doesn't work very well, so. With those, are kind of a baseline setting, if you have really a lot of QRN, uh, coming in from somebody's uh, premises close to you, making noise, so let me just show you that again. Now, so, um, as they're fond of saying in the States, your mileage may vary, but uh, that's what works very well with me, dealing with this noise here on 40 meters and uh, you know it doesn't really impact the uh, doesn't impact the signal and it just gets rid of it altogether you can actually see that noise on the scope there all those little horizontal lines just get in a bit closer there that that's that pulse noise and it's pretty much the whole width of the band there I don't know what the hell it is so there we go another quick video on the ICOM IC7300 and uh, be sure to subscribe and uh, tell your friends to subscribe if you have a buddy that's got a new 7300 and he's trying to wrap his head around it. And uh, come back and see us again. This is George, EI7 Kilo Oscar, 7-3, bye-bye.